welcome in, welcome in everybody. It is Sunday late afternoon, I shall say. And I am fixing to leave our yard here in Steinbach, Manitoba. Yeah. It's about time to go back on the road. We've had a few days off now. Yep. Now we gotta get back on the road and make some miles. Looks like a gorgeous day today. It was a little bit cloudy there earlier, but sort of cleared up a little bit. And if you want to know where we're going, well, we are going on a very, very nice trip. 100 meters, turn well done, <laughs> highway 52. Yeah, we are going to go to uh, a place that, well, I don't know if I've been at the exact same place before, but uh, We are going to go to uh, Texas. Yes. That is a very, very nice trip. Continue on this road for 21 kilometers. Unfortunately, we wanted to go on a short trip me and my wife and that was unfortunately not possible and it was not because of me or really the dispatch you know what really happened is uh, because it's weekend long weekend they uh, were not able to find a load that I could deliver somewhere and be back for Monday evening and so since they told me that yesterday I think they told me that yesterday or was it even yeah yesterday uh, morning or midday they told me that 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 wasn't going to happen and unfortunately they were not able to find one load like that they said they had a load that could take me uh, on a short trip but they had absolutely nothing coming back from there to Winnipeg or Steinbach or something like that so pretty much had no other choice than to just say all right and then instead of sitting home till uh, Monday evening or Tuesday I would just go with a long trip then and so they gave me a long trip and now we are on our way to Texas I was kind of a little bit sad that me and my wife wasn't able to go on a long trip you know that would have been so much fun for my wife and myself we had everything arranged with our friends so they could uh, our son could stay at our friend's place and uh, our daughter could stay at the, at the place where she always stays at Speed limit reduced ahead. but that is a life of a trucker you cannot always have it the way you want it and that was one of the reasons why I chose to drive to Seattle to be logger fair because I know it's not always possible to get you a load close in the area or get you there on time and I figured it would be a better chance of me getting there if I drove there with the car than trying to get a load over there you know 
bit. That's the way it is. Like I said, that's the life of a trucker. You gotta go with the flow, I guess. When you get it, enjoy it. And uh, well, if you don't get it, well, don't be disappointed. That's, uh, that's just the way it goes. There are not always loads in the direction you want to go. That's just a fact. We are going through Mitchell right now. Heading towards the border. We're going to be crossing Heminan, North Dakota today. Speed warning. Alright. I know it's late in the afternoon already, so I know there ain't going to be that much of a video today. Well, in the last few days anyways, so it hasn't been much, but I tried to put something together. But yesterday was actually really hard because the, the night before we only got home at like 1.15 in the morning after watching the movie and all that stuff, you know. Then uh, we slept in the truck. Actually, that's what we did. Me and my wife, uh, my wife actually came up with the idea. She said, well, she had it so much in her heart that she wanted to go on a trip with me. She said, uh, well, since we don't have the kids around, around, she said, why don't we sleep in the truck for one night? I said, hell, that's a good idea. I'm used to the truck. The truck is sitting in the driveway. I said, why not? So when we got home, we jumped in the truck and slept in the truck for one night. Yeah. Yep. But that's the way it goes. So let's continue on with our journey. And have ourselves a fine afternoon, I guess you could say. Welcome to North Dakota. Yes. We have just made it across the border. Everything looks nice and green up here, that's for sure. Mind you, we have had a lot of rain here in the last couple of days. So you would expect to see everything nice and green, right? Yeah, at least I think so. I don't know, today at the border there, the guy seemed to be a new guy at the booth there and he was just pretending to be a little tough today I respect him he gotta do his job I gotta do my job and then we're out of there didn't take me very long but same to have taken the uh, two guys ahead of me there's like two trailer and two trucks ahead of me there and same to take them a while to get through there but oh well no matter what, he let me go. Yep, well, that's the way it goes. You know, it looks like we got more construction going up on here on I-29 again. So we'll see how far we can make it tonight. I kind of like to make it at least to Grand Forks. That would be the minimum I would like to do. I'd really like to get down to Fargo, but that's kind of far. Because it's already 7 o'clock right now. It's probably an hour and, and a bit anyways to, to Grand Forks. So we'll see how far we will go. Let's get down the road and have ourselves an awesome trip up to there. We have made it as far as Grand Forks, North Dakota. Yes. That's about as far I went. As I went, yep, I just figured I could continue on to Fargo. But I decided instead of going to Fargo, I would stop earlier. And that way it goes in cycles. So that way tomorrow morning, I'll be able to leave earlier too. Right? I mean, I'm stopping earlier, just have my 10 go again. So, uh, so we should be good to go. And so I figured, well, I'm just going to put my closure in and uh, put this video together real quick because it's a shorter one, so there's not a lot of stuff I got to do to this particular video. Get it put together and then uh, tomorrow I can upload it. 
and uh, hey I will go to bed here pretty soon but I know it's been a bit of a shorter video today but I don't know if you have noticed I am wearing my YouTube shirt yes I am I love it I like my YouTube shirts actually I went and ordered some more the other day <laughs> yep but anyways it's supposed to cool down here pretty good it's only supposed to go down to like nine degrees and it's getting too closer and closer to winter but hey nothing we can do about it right but uh, hey that's all about what we got be sure to rate us up the thumbs up and we will see you again tomorrow I am really hoping tomorrow will be a better video It'll be a nice long video again. Hopefully we can make that happen for you guys. So stick around and we'll have a good show again tomorrow. Have a good one. It's time to get going. It's time to move on. Put this behind me. That day is gonna come.